What better way to forget about my loss than by dropping in on Paula and her Texas oranges? The difference between liquor and liqueur. Liquor is just um, another word for spirit, something that has alcohol in liquor. it. And then a liqueur is actually a legal classification of liquor that's in the code for alcoholic beverages. And then my friend Steve McKenna is a liquor. When he gets drunk, he likes to lick people's faces. This is the product here. Can I try it straight out of the bottle? Just give it a nice, I'm so a bad nice at sipping sniff inside. because what's really great about Paula's Texas Orange is the orange essence in there. You're like P. Diddy, you talk about yourself in third person. And sometimes I'm like, hey, Zane wants a water. So it's because Zane's thirsty. So, and it's good. <laughs> this tastes good on its own. It does. It's very good. Uh, liqueurs are often just for sipping on their own. You could just put that over ice. Ice and some good friends. There you go. Some music. All right, so in order to make this, we start with oranges. Fresh oranges, we look for the orangest oranges we can find. We need nice color because, uh, sound, that sound again, that's silly. what gives this product all its color right there. All right, so this is a very orange orange. This is the classic kitchen way to peel an orange. So you just go around and take just the uh, colored part off. We have to peel about six boxes of these oranges for every batch we make. At this pace, that will take about seven okay, days. Cool. Is Chris faster? He can whip it out. Well, no, I just want him to peel an orange. Oh, right. That he, yeah. Uh -huh. OK, ready? We're going to have a contest between Chris and, and Paula. Howdy, Mark. Get set. Go. Oh, now you're doing it fast, Paula. Almost. I, I think you I, won. No, I did not win because I left a lot of the necessary stuff on there. And that's it? That's it. Now, what do you do with the rest of the orange? Well, we make some orange juice to drink at home and... Uh... Give them to people's pets to eat. So we fill these up with orange peels. Right. We start with um, a 55-gallon barrel of the ethanol. This is a 55-gallon drum of alcohol. It's technically ethanol. It's a it's a corn-based neutral spirit. What we do is actually run it through some charcoal uh, filtering here. You know, when you take a shot of something, it gives you a little yeah. hoo. -hoo. We take that a little hoo. -hoo. We, we take that part out. This is why you can swig ours from the bottle. Can Very you imagine nice if I was like, if I took a sip of vodka, I'm like, it's got that extra. <laughs> yeah, that, uh, uh, everybody yeah. know what you're talking they about. They know what I was talking about. 190 proof. Right, and oh. you really can't drink this straight. Off. I couldn't drink the whole thing. Uh, not the whole thing, but uh, really any of it. So then, really? Yeah. So we're starting with this. Are you a little scared that maybe I'll go in there and take a sip of it? A little bit. Oh God, that is amazing. That will start on fire. In my stomach? Oh, in the air. God. Oh. Steve McKenna drinks that as a sports drink. I see. Yeah. We should make your signature cocktail. We're going to make um, Paula's Perfect Punch. I was a little hesitant to come here because I thought that you were going to punch me. Are you? If you drink this, you're going to punch me? Is that what's happening? What's the punch? The fist? Or the drink? The drink. So this comes on every bottle. Three ounces of Paula's Texas Orange. That's this. That would be that. Three ounces. That's hefty. Well, you see, One, the interesting two, thing about this three. is that it does have other ingredients. Like three ounces of mango <laughs> nectar. Hmm, how am I going to fit that in there? All right, well, this is mango ne nectar. I didn't go to school the day that they explained the ounces. One ounce pineapple juice. That's easy. And then... Some club soda, but that's really just to <laughs> give it a little, uh, little heft, you know? Am I really measuring it that poorly? Yes. One ounce lime juice, and then eight ounces of club soda. <laughs> How much club soda do you think is in there? 20-something ounces. 20-something ounces. What if we did this? You really are going to punch me now, right? That looks like about... About eight? eight? Yeah. This is not <laughs> typically how it's done. <laughs> Just for good measure. Oh, yeah, that, thanks, Paula. Uh, yeah, that, that, that's what it needed. Let's review. Paula's Punch has Paula's Texas Orange Liqueur, Mango Juice, Pineapple Juice, Lime Juice, and Club Soda. Cheers. Cheers. And that's Paula's Punch. <laughs> Jeez, Paula.